On a pleasant good Monday morning, it's the 19th day of July. It is very humid today. Yes, it's going to be muggy. It's going to be in the mid 80s across town. But the humidity is going to make it feel warmer. And uh, it was 88 yesterday. And yes, it's, it's going to be warm this week, but it, by the weekend it's going to cool down. Um, the, the Dodgers have a big four game series against the hated Giants as well. And tonight it's going to be Kevin Gosman against Tony Gonzalez. With Kershaw still out and with Trevor Bauer not available. At least we got Urias and Bueller pitching in this series. So I I mean if we take three out of four, we should be in good shape. But no worse than a split. But I'd say we take three out of four. But a four game sweep's gonna be really hard. And the Angels are up in Oakland. And the Angels have not had any success against the A's this year, though. So it's NoCal versus SoCal. Um, also, the Cardinals play the Cubs. That's also a rivalry matchup. Uh, the Mets play the Reds. The Indians play the Astros. The Red Sox play the uh, Blue Jays. And... Uh, the Yankees are off today. They have a mini two-game series against the Phillies and a rematch of the 2009 World Series. But a happy birthday going out to Preston Wilson and to Rick Ankeel, also to Alan Goria, the average white band. And also a happy birthday to the late Stuart Scott. Um, so we'll just have to wait and see what happens this week. Hopefully we'll be in first place by the end of the week because after we play the Giants, we play the Rockies, but next week we go up to San Francisco for three games. Yeah, that's going to be huge as well. And uh, let's hope that Corey Seager comes back this week sometime because we really need his bat. Of course, he was our playoff hero last year. And like I said, repeating in baseball is very hard to do. Yeah, Joe Torre, of course, was the last manager to lead the Yankees to consecutive World Series, you know. That was back more than two decades ago in the late 90s. And of course, on the last National League team were of course, were the Cincinnati Reds back in the 70s that went back to back, led by Sparky Anderson. But it's going to be tough to make it back to the World Series as well. I mean, back to back World Series appearances are great, but back to back championships is even harder. Yeah. And of course, tomorrow is game six of the NBA Finals back in Milwaukee where the Bucks will try to win their first championship since 71 when they had Oscar Robertson and Lou Alcindor back then, but he's now known today as Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. And I'm sure Kareem would like to see his old team win a championship, like he's seen his Lakers win a lot too. So we have a connection. Yeah. Kareem was the best. All right, well, have a good rest of your day and stay safe and stay cool. All right, let's go Dodgers and let's go Angels. Later.